flooded district. And I'm in a strange duel with a mad witch named Delilah for the fate of the Empire. I'd say I was being punished, but I know that the world doesn't punish wicked people. We make our choices and take what comes. And the rest is void. I can't say I wasn't warned. It's been months since I killed the Empress, but it feels like only seconds ago I heard her yelling for her daughter, Emily. Corvo's face going slack with shock, and somewhere in my head the outsiders laugh. Come to collect on our debt. Did you ever think you deserved to lose your Empress? That a better man took her life while you gaped like a fool? Come on, Corvo. Prove me wrong. has returned with the information you requested. He's waiting for you below. Lizzie's tried. Getting her to lend us her boat will be a bit complicated, however. She's in Coldridge. From what I hear, they've got enough on her to hold her for about a thousand years. Excellent. Lizzie has enemies inside Coldridge. If we play this right, she'll be begging to do business with us. Yes, sir. Your tools have been cleaned and placed in the chest over there. I'll wait here until you're ready to leave. Ready to go. Soon as you've got your gear. After Corvo's escape, it's going to be more difficult to break into Coldridge. They've installed arc pylons, and they're blurring overseer music over the loudspeakers. Our talents will be suppressed until inside. I have other talents. <laughs> 